Hello guys, well, I'm back to my reaction channel. Today we're going to be reacting to One Piece episode 48. Yes guys, we finished this amazing arc a few episodes back with Nami joining us finally as a crew member. That was one emotional ass arc man, around Nami, her backstory all that. But now, episode 45, I, I watched episode 46, episode 47 before I watched episode 45, so episode 45 is the freshest in my memory. And yeah, they revealed a lot, Mihawk knows Shanks, and, and yo, a lot happened that episode. But at the very last episode, episode 47, we arrived at this city, they're calling it the city of the beginning and end. Which is kind of a dope concept because the name itself represents the Pirate King, Gold Roger, as you guys told me in the comments. Apparently my man was born here and executed here. So really, yo, this is probably the beginning of a new arc. I'm very excited about it because I have a lot of questions about this so-called Pirate King that Luffy himself seems to be admiring so much. Because if he was the Pirate King, what, what does that title even entail? The Hokage is ahead of a village. So since this Pirate King was executed, do we have another Pirate King right now? Do we need to overthrow that one? Like you usually always have a next Hokage, right? So what, nobody's on the throne right now? There has to be somebody on the throne always. Right, and when you're the pirate king, what, what does that even entail? Are you commanding all the pirates? Are you the top dog? Do you have like a fleet of ships like Don Krieg had? Like what, what is actually coming with that title? Why is it, right? What, I don't know, and his treasure, One Piece? I have a lot of questions. I really have a lot, I think it's a dope concept about this pirate. So yeah, this is the town where he was born at and executed. Yo, I really, I really do hope they tell us a whole backstory about this guy. So I'm here for it. That being said, I ain't gonna on this that much. If you enjoy my reactions, feel free to share, subscribe, like, leave a comment, ring the bell for notifications, guys. Follow me on Instagram, join my Discord server, and my Patreon page. Rough for the two, man. Let's jump right into this reaction. Let's go. <laughs> オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。オッケー。
あなた様のようなお方は大歓迎でございますいやどうですこれはあのゴールドロジャーが愛用していた銃なんですよ No, that's that's fake. There's no way. Gold Roger is the pirate king, right? The one that was executed in this city. This is a tourist attraction, of course. If they have a, a platform that was used to, like, he was executed on that platform and they still have it around, that means everything here is gonna be around the pirate king because he's infamous, right? Hi! Oh, <laughs> 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 スモーカー大佐大変でありますスモーカー本部より連絡ですモンキー・ディ・ルフィという海賊の一味がこのローグタウンに向かったとの情報が入りましたおう、うん、で何だってあはい海賊団です今日にもこの町に現れそうとのことでしてはい報告いたします港に海賊が現れたとの情報が入りましたすぐにお越しくださいきっとルフィ一味です乗り込んできたに違いありません三千万ね少しは歯応えがあることを祈るよは一人ごとだ気にすんな Bro, what the hell? So they have a marine base in this town and Luffy and other pirates still come here? No, fam, it's like serving yourself up on a platter Why would you risk it? I guess they need to stock up on supplies so every harbor day Port in is a potential threat. And this guy, they call him Smoker? What the hell, bro? My man's smoking his ass off in this office. Did you see the smoke? The amount of smoke was crazy. My man opened a window so we can see him. He looks ripped, he looks confident and cool. So, and he just said, like, no pirate ever escaped him once they entered this town. So, okay, okay, I guess we should deem him a threat. Justice, okay. <laughs> oh, it's this guy. Yo, that's a lot of cigars. <laughs> oh, they know him. Oh, come on, please don't be a dick. Come on, is this Marine again gonna be a scumbag like that first one that trapped Zoro and then Luffy had to save Zoro? Come on, let's have a decent Marine for once, bro. This guy looks badass. Maybe not make him a scumbag because I'm starting to hate the Marines, bro. Come on. Warina. Oh, thank you. My pants ate your. Thank you. Ooh, yeah, that was nice. And I, yo, thank you, bro. Thank you, Sean. I, I was really starting to get pissed at the Marines. Is there a normal Marine here? Come on, bro. That's a kid. Okay. He, 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 was, he was really kind. He gave her the money. And he apologized. That's a real man right there. Let's go. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, looks like this guy has some sort of... What's with all the smoke? Uh, doesn't matter. Uh, doesn't he... They, they're supposed to have flyers. And the flyer literally has Luffy on it. How is this guy... I guess he didn't look at the flyer. My man didn't seem interested. He thinks this is Luffy? And this is another pirate crew causing trouble. Okay. Yo. Smoker, Taisa. Ah, Kaigun Hombu Kitte no Mosa de Ne. Gizen Kodomachiwa Grand Line and Norikom Kaizok Tach no Tamari Badatta no Yo. Oh. Tokoro ga Taisa ga shikiru yo ni natte kara wa Kodomachi ni haitta Kaizok ga hitori no koratsu Kangok iki. Konna shiketa hai ga 3000 man ja yo mo sue de. Damn, my man is actually low key excited about facing Luffy. I don't think Luffy can take on a strong marine. Like, Luffy, I mean, he's strong, don't get me wrong, but I think he came this far with sheer luck. <laughs> but listen, he does have Sanji, Zoro, Usopp, Nami, and now uh, Luffy, of course, as well. So, five of them are strong. They're a strong pirate crew. I mean, I guess. 
way stronger than the casuals. These guys were casuals. And my man was able to recognize that these guys can't be... Like, they couldn't be Luffy's pirates because the bounty doesn't match their strength. And my man didn't even look at the flyer. He doesn't even know who Luffy is. He just knows how to calculate somebody's strength level. And he has a devil fruit? Yeah, it's going to have something to do with this smoke. That's why he has so many cigars, bro. Yo, this guy, Captain Smoker. I like this guy. Oh, my God. Really? Oh! Really? <laughs> Please, for the love of God, for once, do not introduce yourself. My man is gonna flat out say, Oh yeah, I'm Monkey D. Luffy. Nice to meet you. <laughs> to the commander of this... Man, come on. Really? Luffy just approached him to ask for directions. That is crazy. Gallows? Yo. So he doesn't know that's Luffy. That's good. That's good. What the hell did I just say, bro? I said this at the beginning of this damn episode. She's the only one that has money. But you better not borrow money from Nami. She's gonna ask for interest. Man, I know this character so well already. I love it. I absolutely love this detail. Yeah. <laughs> oh, she's a swordsman? Oh, she knows how to fight. <laughs> Yo, is nobody weak on this island? What the hell is happening? Yeah, I do believe that that captain, Smoker, mentioned that a girl wasn't at her post. So is she a Marine too? I think he was referring to her because these guys tried to, like, pay, get payback for the captain busting their captain. I think I understood this situation. Let's go. Yo, Zoro was impressed. He broke her glasses. Ah! <laughs> he has no money! <laughs> Yo, did she remind him of the girl that died, unfortunately, from his childhood? I already forgot her name, bro, but R.I.P. Yeah, the girl that he shares a dream with, is that why he reacted that way? Damn. I guess she does look like her. Yo, the sound is divine, like in a church. Yeah, this is like the vibe that it's giving me. It's like a church, like church gathering, the, the way the sound in the background, it's literally like in the church. And also these city streets remind me of Italy. It's very similar to Venice, for example, in Italy, like the way that the, the streets are and the, the buildings are. I kind of love it. Even the pier. <laughs> おもてのかんばんに書いてあったゴールドロジャーってなこの店の名前かお境内のあるところに行きたかったんだけどさ行き方教えてくんねえかなんテーブルの上に乗ってんの何うよテーブルの上に乗ってんの何うよテーブルの
<笑>最近じゃこの手の話に乗ってくるやつも少なくなっちまってるのにな。なあなあなあ、shut the hell up. These are the best tales, bro. My grandpa, not like, not like this, but he has his own stories and I love to listen, bro. Maybe the new generations don't like this, but shiz, bro. I love this. I would definitely glue myself to that. Share and listen, man. Like these old folk tales are the best. Let's go. Pesky kid. <laughs> Gold Roger. I know the day. Yeah, I'm not the mocha. いやーまずいわけじゃねえんだが悪いことは言わねえあそこだけはやめときな誰も帰ってきたことがねえんだ<笑>泥木よりも嬉しさで年がいもなく興奮しちまってな<笑>いやおそれも今は昔ロジャーは22年前の今日処刑台で死んだ20 years ago あの日を境に腕っぷしに自信のあるやつはみんな海賊の名乗りをあげたゴールドロジャー、yeah! やっぱ海賊はこうでなくちゃだから俺は海に出たんだグランドラインに行ってワンピースを手に入れて俺は海賊王になるダイオン Yeah, like, like I said, I have a lot of questions, bro. Do we have a current pirate king? How does that even work? Yo, this was so dope, bro. Yo, we just got to see the pirate king himself before he conquered the Grand Line. My man was drinking. He was like, yo, I'm gonna go to the Grand Line and have me a little stroll, bro. My man conquered that bitch. He was not afraid at all. And Luffy really reminds me of that energy. Cause let's be honest, my man Luffy ain't afraid of anything, right? So maybe... Hey, I might go on a limb here and say something outlandish, but what do you want to bet Gold Roger is actually Luffy's dad, bro? Because we haven't gotten Luffy's backstory, right? And he seems to really, really like Roger. So maybe this is going to be a Hunter Hunter thing where Gon is chasing after his dad and his tales of, of victories and all that, right? And maybe we're just going to find that out later in the series, but... Yeah, just his energy alone reminds me of the guy that this old man is talking about, a gold Roger. <gasps> yeah, see? Even the old man knows! That's not a joke, but it's not a joke. You're in the middle of this place. I'm just saying that I'm just saying that I'm just saying that. Yo, it's that guy! Get the mega! You're a bit of a joke. I'm looking at the door. 店を潰そうとするやつがふざけたこと抜かすな<笑>俺を恨むのはお門違いってやつだぜほらてめえの仕事に忠実なだけだ今日の海賊どもが腰抜けなのが悪いんだよ<笑> Oh my god he's a part of the problem he's a part of the reason why this old man doesn't have customers cause yeah he's chasing off all the pirates busting them right putting them in a jail cell so nobody's actually coming here cause they would be slim pickings this guy would know where to come so no customers at all is Luffy still there though bruh he's looking for Luffy I hope Luffy got out of there hmm? <laughs> Yeah. Rum or no Yeah. Kyo Oh my god, we're getting the backstory. Well, how did he get this man? Yo, this marine was there! Yo, the gallows! Saigo,にいうことはあるか。こいつを外してくれ。かゆくてしょうがねえんだ。それはできん。この俺が逃げるかよ。<笑> Why would I run away now? Because they're trying to kill you! What, what, what is... Bro, he doesn't care! That he's about to die! Where did he go? Where did he go? Where did he go? 
く喋るな欲しけりゃくれてやる探せこの世のすべてをそこに置いてきた What the hell? Yo, they pierced him! Look at what the hell! Yo, that's brutal! No way! Oh. No way! Oh, he's in front of the platform! Bro! He's in front of the platform! He's in front of the platform! He's in front of the platform! The place of the beginning. That, that, like, this is the city of the beginning of, and the end. Isn't the end part where he died? What do you mean the beginning? Bro, I'm so confused. I guess. I don't know. I guess when he died, the beginning part is the fact that、uh, everybody is now searching for his One Piece treasure. Is that right? Does that. Are they referring to that? Like, that's when everybody started. Because before, while he's,、uh, he was alive, nobody was searching for that treasure because he was so OP. I have so many questions, though. Who the hell managed to kill this man? Who the hell managed to apprehend this man? If he was such a big shot, if he was so strong that no pirate could even touch him, the greatest pirate that ever lived? Are you kidding me? And he was apprehended by those mere weaklings and, and executed by those mere weaklings. The, these guys look like casual father characters that executed him. Not a single strong marine in sight, bruh. Like, this smoker looks stronger than all of these guys that, right? Executed the pirate king himself. I am so confused, bro. He didn't even fight back. My man was smiling the entire time. He, he just said, Take these off. They said that we can't do that. He was like, It's not like I'm gonna run now, implying that he could run any, at any point, but he just didn't want to. Why would anybody wanna die? Did he wanna inspire the people? Because before, before he got on that platform, he kinda had that inner monologue, or maybe he was talking to everybody. I, I wasn't sure. He said something as long as people are pursuing freedom. Like this will continue to happen. Something like, I, I don't know, bro. Something like that. But yeah, this was low key inspiring. Even this guy, Smoker, when he was a kid, he was actually smiling seeing the Pirate King, right? I'm not sure if he was smiling because he was apprehended or because he was inspiring, but my man was smiling while being carried to his execution. That's crazy. That is absolute craziness. So, if his smile made the kid smile, why did that kid choose to become a marine and not a pirate? I am so confused. And he was executed and the whole city cheered. This is, bro, this is like, this town is like upside down, bro. Everything is diff. Like, what? <laughs> I am so confused, bro. And now Luffy is in front of the platform where the greatest pirate that ever lived was executed. And he's not smiling anymore. My man is feeling the pressure. He's like, yo, yo, I'm actually standing here. And he was there when it happened. And this guy, Smoker, finally got the. Right, the bounty and saw that that's Luffy. Okay, so it's not that he was too lazy to look before, they just didn't receive it yet. Nah, fam, that is actually insane. So Luffy's in trouble. This guy, Smoker, looks like he can manipulate smoke or something. I'm pretty sure he grabbed that、uh, rum bottle with smoke dish. Man, he has the devil fruit. How do you? There's no way, bro. My man can manipulate smoke. Like, can't that go into your lungs and then you die? Like, that's OP. Like, not even Luffy's rubber can. Like, nah, I, I, I'm, I'm tripping, bro. I'm tripping. But,、uh, yeah, this is.、Uh, yo, this episode was something else, bro. I really, I really enjoyed hearing those old folk tales and just the, the adventure. Yeah, this, this anime is somehow free. You know, when I watch it, it's just like freedom, like, like open sea, sailing with friends, like pursuing your dreams and your happiness, and just freeing people, right, from Arlong's grasp, from, from Marines, from. You just, right? And the way they're establishing the Marines right now, it's like they're, right, a regime of authority that I,、uh, I don't really like them. Like, most of them are scumbags. This guy, Smoker, seems like he's a swell dude, but he's still gonna go after Luffy indiscriminately, so. I'm rooting for our boy Luffy, so I'm, I'm not with him either. So, yeah, yeah, this is gonna be, this, but,、uh, this is gonna be crazy. But that being said, I ain't gonna pull on this that much. I really enjoyed this episode. Hope you enjoyed the reaction. And I'll see you in the next one, which I am gonna be jumping into right now. Stay safe. Love you. Enjoy. And bye.